The Robinair 75700 Cool Exchange is the finest, most reliable coolant exchanger on the market today. It offers you everything you need to quickly remove and replace the coolant in any vehicle. Robinair engineers have designed the 75700 with productivity, safety, and simplicity in mind. From its dual coolant supply tanks to its uniquely simple controls, the 75700 takes the lead in versatility and speed. You can service hot or cold systems. No waiting for an engine to warm up or cool down. The 75700 features rugged construction from top to bottom and is built with quality parts throughout. All of the fittings are brass, not like the plastic fittings found on comparable machines. These quality fittings decrease wear and ensure good connections are made to the vehicle. The 75700 Cool Exchange is built to give you years of trouble-free service. The impact-resistant polypropylene cabinet will not scratch or dent the vehicle, and it's impervious to chemicals commonly used in the shop. Large inflatable tires and casters carry a well-balanced platform easily across any shop floor. And there's more. Look at what you don't need. Shop Air powers this unit. There are no electrical hazards associated with fluids and electricity. This safety feature of the 75700 is not found on comparable machines. Service is performed with the engine off, so no additional ventilation is required, and there's no moving fans or belts to endanger the technician. There are no hoses to cut. All connections are made at places convenient for your service tech to access. The coolant transfer process is quick and easy. Make the simple connections and select the desired process and the 75700 with its intuitive design does the rest. A typical exchange procedure may take only 10 minutes. In the next few minutes, you'll see how the 75700 Cool Exchange is easy to set up and operate. Once you see how the 75700 performs, you'll agree. Its simple design will save you time. First, let's quickly run through the initial setup of the 75700 Cool Exchange. Once the unit is ready, you'll be ready to save time and make more profit from your coolant service. Detailed instructions on the setup of the 75700 Cool Exchange can be found in the owner's manual. Please refer to the manual for a comprehensive procedure. The 75700 Cool Exchange comes standard with hose clamps, hose segments, and a wide variety of step adapters. The hose segments and step adapters allow quick and easy vehicle connections. To begin, attach the black hose to the top coupler on the upper left side of the unit's rear panel. The decal next to the coupler is marked coolant outlet to car. Now, attach the clear hose to the bottom coupler marked coolant inlet from car. After verifying that valve 1 and valve 2 on the 75700 unit are in the off position, connect a user-supplied air coupler fitting to the air supply inlet. This fitting is where you will attach the shop airline. 80 to 120 PSI of clean compressed air is required for operation. The two external coolant supply tanks shipped with the 75700 allow onboard storage of two coolant types. Fill one supply tank with new coolant and install the dip tube cap on the tank. You may fill the second supply tank with a different type of coolant, or you might leave it empty at this time. The tanks are designed to fit side by side on the back of the unit. Secure them with a Velcro strap. Finally, attach the supply hose coupler to the dip tube cap. There you have it. The 75700 Cool Exchange is ready for action. Ready to be the coolant exchange workhorse of your service bay. Ready to turn your investment into cash. Now that the 75700 Cool Exchange is ready, let's see a brief overview of how your shop can efficiently and profitably change the coolant in any type of engine. We'll show you a typical engine type for our example. 
there may be some systems that require a slightly different connection arrangement or other modifications. For example, some vehicle cooling systems are designed as reverse flow cooling systems. This means the coolant flows to different parts of the engine in a different order than traditional systems. It is not easy to determine which vehicles have reverse flow designs. However, one indication of reverse flow cooling systems is a slow exchange process or a high reading on the pressure gauge. Should this occur, simply switch the connections and continue with the exchange. Consult the owner's manual for additional detail. On vehicles that have a radiator cap, it is possible to relieve pressure by drawing a vacuum on the overflow port. First, select the siphon tube which most closely matches the size of the coolant overflow barb on the vehicle's radiator neck. Connect the coupler end of the siphon tube to the clear hose from the 75700 unit. Remove the vehicle's overflow tank hose from the coolant overflow barb on the radiator neck. Slide the siphon tube onto the coolant overflow barb on the radiator neck. Turn both valves on the unit to vacuum. As the valve in the radiator cap releases pressure, coolant may be seen in the siphon tube. After pressure is relieved, turn both valves off. Before starting the service procedure, verify that the following is correct. The 75700 unit is connected to a supply tank holding the correct amount and type of new coolant for the vehicle being serviced. The waste coolant tank has enough capacity to exchange the desired amount of coolant. Running the unit with a full waste tank will disable the ability of the unit to pull vacuum. Verify the vehicle's ignition is in the off position. Valves 1 and 2 on the 75700 are off. The valve on the black hose is open. The filter screen on the clear hose is clean. After the hoses are connected correctly, all the technician has to do is select the mode of operation. During the exchange process, the tech can observe the supply tank and the waste line coming from the vehicle. When the predetermined amount of coolant is exchanged and the color of the coolant in the waste line matches that of the new coolant, the technician can stop the exchange by positioning valves 1 and 2 to the off position. Finished. And it took only 10 minutes. Imagine how many turns a day you can have in the service bay. The math is simple. More exchanges per day equals more profits for your business. Look at the following chart and fill in the numbers for your shop. On average, the 75700 pays for itself in three to five months. There is another valuable feature of the 75700, the pressurized leak test. To do this test, turn the regulator on the 75700 control panel counterclockwise to lower the test pressure. Note, adjusting the regulator requires pulling up on the regulator knob and then turning the knob. Turn valve one to pressure test. Turn valve two to pressurize. Adjust the regulator clockwise to the correct test pressure. Caution, to prevent damage to the vehicle, test pressure must range below the pressure indicated on the radiator cap, overflow cap, or vehicle specifications. Turn valve two to hold. Observe the pressure gauge on the control panel. A constant pressure reading indicates no leaks in the system. A drop in pressure indicates a leak in the system that must be repaired. Finally, the drain the waste tank feature uses the air driven pump on the 75700 to transfer the old coolant via the black hose into your shop's waste fluid receptacle. To enhance your service capabilities, SPX Robin Air also offers you a complete line of accessories. The 75700 Cool Exchange comes standard with hose clamps, hose segments, and a wide variety of step adapters. You may also order the 75360 Heavy Duty Adapter Kit for larger vehicle application, and an extra 7-gallon tank, part number 75370. For your convenience, the owner's manual lists replacement parts 
as well as a full line of additional coolant service accessories for the 75700. Maintaining the 75700 cool exchange is as easy and trouble-free as its operation. Complete details on maintenance and troubleshooting the 75700 are readily available in the easy-to-read owner's manual. Robin Air stands behind this product and all of its products with a full one-year warranty and a national service network of 150 service centers. In today's competitive world of automotive service, time is money. If you like the idea of a 10-minute coolant exchange, a safer work environment for your service technician, and a machine that is simple to operate with an exceptional return on investment, then the Robin Air 75700 Cool Exchange is the right choice, the only choice for your automotive service business. To get more information about the 75700 Cool Exchange or to place an order, visit our website to find the distributor nearest you. The Robin Air 75700 Cool Exchange. Simplicity by design.